Soren Kierkegaard was born on May 5, 1813, in Copenhagen, Denmark. He was the youngest of seven children born to Michael Pedersen Kierkegaard, a prosperous wool merchant, and his wife, Anne Sorenstatter Lund. At the age of 15, Kierkegaard began his studies at the University of Copenhagen, where he studied theology, philosophy, and literature. He took a keen interest in the works of the German philosopher, Johann Gottfried Herder, and the Danish philosopher, Hans Lassen Martinsen. As a student, Kierkegaard was also influenced by the works of the German idealist philosopher, Georg Wilhelm Friedrich Hegel, whose philosophy he later sharply criticized. After completing his studies, Kierkegaard was torn between pursuing a career in academia or ministry. He became engaged to Regina Olsen, but later broke off the engagement, which had a profound effect on his life and work. Kierkegaard made his literary debut with a series of essays published in 1843 under the pseudonym Vigilius Hafniensis. The essays discussed the nature of faith and love, and attacked the religious establishment of his time. In 1844, Kierkegaard published his first major work, Either, or, which explored the nature of individual freedom and choice. The book was a critical success and established Kierkegaard as one of Denmark's leading intellectuals. In 1846, Kierkegaard published, Concluding Unscientific Postscript, a scathing critique of Hegelianism and an affirmation of Christian faith as a way of life. Kierkegaard continued to produce influential works, including Fear and Trembling and The Sickness Unto Death, which explored the psychological and religious dimensions of human existence. Despite his success as a writer, Kierkegaard remained a solitary figure and struggled with depression and physical ailments. He died on November 11, 1855, at the age of 42. Kierkegaard's works continue to be studied and debated by scholars and laypeople alike, and his legacy lives on as one of the most important and original thinkers of the modern era.